Hello everyone, welcome back to the Zen Lounge. In this video, I'm going to share with you another gem to research and look into on the XRP Ledger. If you were with us last episode, we discussed the top plays in the XRP Ledger. We discussed Sologenic, and we discussed uh, the memes on First Ledger having massive potential. This week, I'm going to bring a new coin to the table. I'm going to be talking about Evernote. I think this project is severely, severely undervalued and something to be paying attention to because last month in the Ripple Insight article, they featured uh, basically Evernote in their article. They funded Ever Evernote and uh, they've been supporters of Evernote. This article came out, uh, Ripple's long-term commitment to blockchain innovation and they are shouting out, acknowledging Evernote. You can also find many posts from David Schwartz acknowledging this project. It's a layer two smart contract play platform for the XRPL. And uh, there's a lot of things happening on this blockchain. I'm gonna share with you some of the bullish points that I have, and I have two different charts to share with you guys. So first off, uh, there's only six, 36 million uh, ever token circulating, which is extremely rare. It's the only DPIN project connected to the XRP ledger, decentralized physical infrastructure. If you guys were holding XRP on uphold, you may remember that you were airdrop ever token. So it would make sense that in the pipeline, there could be a uphold listing. If enough buzz and hype is surrounding this coin. And if we were in an XRP bull run, you guys are around in 2021 when XRP was pumping. You would remember all the legit projects on the XRPL also went insane. There were many projects on the XRPL that went insane. This project didn't exist last bull run. So it's a fresh project that a lot of people aren't aware of. Ripple is talking about it, as you see in their article. I'm by no means an expert on this project. However, I've communicated and talked with many people that are community leaders of this project, and they've shared with me all the cool things about this project. There's already a working use case and product for this project, and uh, it is a true utility project. So maybe you don't want to dabble into the memes or looking for another utility project. Evernote is something you should look into. So from BRW Solo, I have this chart for the short term, and he is calling for 69 cents. You could see right here that it looks ready to go to 69 cents in the short term. Uh, this chart is from Bunny. I just had a Bunny with a video with Bunny uh, discussing the to the technical analysis of Sologenic, and he is saying this could easily go to five to six dollars based on the chart that he's seeing. At the time right now, this coin is only valued at 23 cents, basically. It's at 23 cents. And it's sub 10 million market cap. So this project is for someone. So Sologenic's already 100 plus million market cap. This is below 10 million market cap. So if Evernode were to reach 100 million market cap, we're looking at a 10x. So if you're looking for a 10x play, Everdell could possibly be it. Remember, this is not financial advice. This is my research and uh, speculation that I'm sharing with you guys. So deep in, the deep end for seriously smart uh, decentralized applications. One of the use cases for Evernote is you could lock up your Ever tokens. I believe you need about 500. I could be wrong. And you could create a node. Basically use your server to create a node, which uh, gives you opportunities to earn incentives like passive income. And um, yeah, so this uh, project already has utility. On top of that, uh, if we look at the, the uh, Evernote chart, back in January, we already hit 60 cents. So we already hit 60 cents just this year alone. And according to BRW Solo's chart, we should revisit that level. So 60 cents here is almost 3x. That's almost 3x gains. So uh, when more people start talking about it, more hype is generated. A lot of people don't even know how to buy this token. It's very, very rare. So we're talking about XRPL gems. This is definitely one. And so many people in XRP community talk about Codius. Well, I'll share some 
uh, this guy's research, Anders, talking about how this is basically the second evolution of Codius. And you could actually see, so you can see right here, we recently seen exciting developments surrounding Hooks and Evernode, which together form a global permissionless layer two smart contract platform composed from the XRP ledger. It's compared to Codius. Evernote and Hooks together operate at different layer, but still over overlap in terms of features and usability. Uh, Evernote is the brainchild of Scott Chamberlain and stands as a testament to the evolution of blockchain technology as the replacement for Ever for uh, Codius. And if you actually look at the GitHub channel, you could see on the first page, the consensus engine for Codius is right here, is right here. And this is project is still very much a baby. And I want all the hardcore researchers to post their information in the chat below to share what they have learned about this project because there is a lot to learn. Remember, we've already reached 60 cents earlier this year. Uh, definitely with the XRP hype, when people are not wanting to spend three, four dollars for an XRP, they're going to explore the XRPL ecosystem and see what else is available. You know, we showed you Sologenic, we showed you the memes. How about a deep end project, a smart contract platform? Well, that would be Evernote, which is still below 10 million market cap, and it could easily go to 100 million market cap, which would put it, you know, two dollars and 29 cents, which is still below Bunny's targets of about five to six bucks. This rally, this bull run. So there's a lot of room for growth, and they have an active. They have an active uh, community. Uh, they have an active Telegram, and if we actually look over at their uh, at their uh, Twitter page, they have about thirty thousand uh, followers, and you can see that people are already using this system and launching different, uh, basically, projects on the Evernode blockchain. So you can see someone actually has a decentralized radio station hosted by. Evernode. So I believe basically one, let me just share with you one thing real quick. So who was here back in 2021 when everything was pumping? Do you remember a project called Equilibrium Games? So Equilibrium Games had a hundred million coins circulating and it was also airdrop just like Evernote. Evernote was the airdrop to XRP community. Uh, Equilibrium Games shot up to a hundred mil, uh, shot up to one, one dollar plus in value and there was no utility for it. it was just speculation on the play to earn gains platform i don't think that project ended up doing as good i have to look some look into it to see what's up with them now but if we think about that that equilibrium games a play to earn gaming platform with 100 million coins in circulation reached one dollar plus during the xrp bull rally frenzy of 2021 while the sec was still looming over us uh evernote almost has one fourth of the supply so only 36 million evernote tokens and it's at 22 cents so if it has a rally like equilibrium games i don't see why this project couldn't hit one dollar just like eq games did four years ago because this one actually has a working product and it's also being endorsed in studies at universities of australia uh, they're hosting spaces the dev is active and uh, basically part of the narrative is that the tokens are actually backed by computer power. So you could actually take your, so if we look over here, you could take your Evernode tokens and lease server space from uh, the Evernodes, the decentralized nodes that everyone can connect, that everyone could become a node themselves. So you have 500 uh, Evernode. You could run your node with your servers and people could lease your computer power to host different uh, websites and dApps so you have true decentralized infrastructure. Uh, a lot of the Web3 products don't even have their websites hosted on decentralized uh, platforms. So like decentralized hosting marketplace right here. Evernote creates a marketplace where anyone could offer hosting power in exchange for Ever tokens, the native tokens. So their decentralized applications can run on a decentralized network of hosts 
increasing resilience and censorship resistance. So if you have a basically a renegade idea and you're worried about censorship police shutting down your, your web host, you could plug into Evernode and host your website and be censorship resistant by plugging into these nodes. Uh, they have an amazing uh, tokenomic plan as well. So the rest of the, there's only ever going to be, I believe, uh, 72 million Evernote tokens, but it's going to be a gradually distributed to the nodes over 118 years. So very slow. It's going to take years and years for all these tokens to be distributed, but they do have to have a way to incentivize the node host. So, I'm going to add this coin as something to watch and pay attention to because it is connected to the XRP ledger. And besides the coins I mentioned, uh, Sologenic, Corium, First Ledger, I do not see any product as serious uh, at the market cap it is. It's severely undervalued and it's tricky to get. So you're going to need to connect your wallet to, uh, I'll make a separate video on how to buy, but you need to connect your wallet to X Magnetic, uh, click on AMA. And then basically what you're going to do is, uh, swap your XRP. So you'll swap your XRP. So a hundred XRP right now gets you about 1200 Evernote tokens. So... Yeah, guys, uh, Evernote is something to pay attention to. Um, I'm going to be doing some more research myself, but definitely think this is a project that should not be overlooked. Remember, this is not financial advice. Anything that is a low market cap project comes with risk. But with risk comes high reward. At the peak of the bull run, if we go to 100 million market cap, that is a 10x. So if you're looking for a 10x opportunity, This could be it. All right, everybody. Thank you guys for tuning in. I'll see you guys next video and have an awesome day.